have some information for you about a certain uh, Taraji P. Henson hair weight. Um, I got a couple the other day. This is the package and it's lined with the golden products on either side. The product itself is very, very attractive. Um, it's very smooth and it has its um, brand logo on there. If you can make that out so pretty and then sort of like um with makeup when something has a sort of weight to it which it obviously does it feels a little bit more luxe this is not like cheap material and the finish is glorious there are no bubbles nicks anything that would make it look cheap so um in the looks department it gets 10 out of 10 gorgeous um I don't know if the box states it or not. I weighed these myself on my food scale and um, it came to 0.4 ounces, if anyone was interested. Um, the diameter here is about that of a dime. Uh, between a penny and a dime, it's, it's pretty small. Um, it's got some teeth in there, which I guess keeps it from sliding off, so that's a nice touch too. Um, there are some issues that I found in using them. Um, for my purposes, I um, I don't get a ton of shrinkage, but I wanted my hair to just dry a little bit straighter to make it feel more like a bob. Um, and did it do that? It certainly did, sort of. Um, you see, they come with 10 pieces. And um, I have more than 10 dimes worth of hair. So um, when you think about it, like $15, that's not bad. But can you, can you use that and be satisfied? And the answer for me is no. Um, so there aren't enough in the package for one. And then also just general usage is difficult because if you are trying to fight your shrinkage you're gonna you're gonna use it when your hair is wet and your hands will be wet and you might have some conditioner maybe and um these are so smooth right it's hard to hold in a wet hand but potentially conditioning hand and especially when you try to open it it just loves to just rock it off into nowhere and that's not helpful um i thought about it and i thought you could probably make your own um see these are the clips that i use for my hair and i would get bigger ones if i could locate them if you know where we can get some really just fat ones please let me know um, but you could make your own sizes and you could go and get like small weights and attach them. Now, this is not the way, uh, this is not the way that I would go about it. Um, but when I just gave a cursory, um, Amazon search, it brought up weights for, uh, fishing, which probably wouldn't work for this purpose unless you... Anyway, um, they do have someone called, some called wheel weights. Don't know what they're for, but those were um, 0.25 ounces and they were, um, they had adhesive on the back. They were self-adhesive. Um, so you could probably do something like this, but personally, um, I think, you know, maybe some of you guys are thinking this with me. I would just band my hair it's so convenient um over a year ago i bought this bag of baby hair ties like literally for infants and it's it's just like a beautiful thing i love how bright they are color wise because um i've definitely lost a hair tie in my hair when it was small and black um, and you definitely want to get the ones that are more cloth-like because they, they do expand more than the really rigid ones. Um, so 
whatever your purpose is for wanting to weigh your ha hair down, uh, I just don't think that this is worth the money and because of the size of it, I don't think it's worth the time either. So um, I could use them for some absolutely gorgeous hair weights, but I'm, I'm gonna return these, so that's all. Oh.